Hey guys, welcome back to Come Again TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. I'm Shannon, and today on the show, we're taking a look at Transformers Generations Power of the Primes. This is Terracon Ripper Snapper. So, as you guys know, I'm doing the Abominus uh, Terracons. Uh, and I like to make ripper snapper and blot the legs because i think that's how it looks best have the more colorful ones as the arms and have the uh, more darker colored terracons as the legs so anyway here he is in robot mode and he comes with a card here terracon ripper snapper nexus ripper snapper Combines with beings that make him superior. Okay. And we've got instructions here. And here's the box. Just a clamshell. You got the power of the primes things molded into the uh, plastic. There he is in robot form. There he is in beast form. Uh, let's see, we have Alchemist Prime with Mystical Scientist, Alpha Trion, Infinite Knowledge, Liege Maximo, the Trickster. How will the Ferocious Terracon Ground Attack Specialist wield the power of the Primes? Okay. Move that out of the way. And... I'm gonna go ahead and lower this a little bit right there. Alright, so we're gonna take these guns out. And very easy transformation. Okay, you open up his legs. Uh, this is the hardest part because if you don't get them just right, it doesn't want to close. See? Come on. Close. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it all night long. Oh, yeah, and his head. The only thing you really need to do with this head is when you put him into a uh, leg or arm mode and then it just switches around uh, I mean you can have him like that for beast mode but it's not necessary really I mean yeah it looks slightly better but there see you can barely even tell especially when his mouth is open. All right, so the legs. See this, this part is really tricky. Cause a lot of times just doesn't want to close. Hold tight guys. Okay, so what you want to do is when you're doing that See, there's a little uh, lip thingy right there. You got to make sure it's in there. It's really tiny. Um, I don't understand the purpose behind it, but it's whatever. Bring the legs out just like that. And as you, if you didn't notice, I turned, I rotated the uh, waist around. Then you just these fins were like that. You just bring them out and you'll clip them together. Just like that. Then you'll just rotate the hands around. And you have Ripper Snapper in beast mode. You take his guns and they just peg in right back here. 
Same with the other side. See, these Terracons have a really simple transformation. Uh, the, the hardest part about the transformation I've found is getting the legs just right. So, let's go ahead and put him into arm mode first, and then we'll do leg mode since I prefer him to be in uh, as one of the legs. Um, so, oops, sorry about that, guys. Really? Just open that back up. And you want to make sure the leg is just right so that that piece that we had such a hard time getting into place before lines up with that part there. You can see. So it locks it into place just like that. Same with this side. Just like that. Then take the fins, put them back. And we'll clip these together so you can see this goes in there that goes in there all right we're gonna rotate it around so the fins are on the outside okay and bring his legs And we're going to let's see here. There's see that hole right there. There's a peg right there. Or no, it'd be this hole here. Pegs in right there. Holds them into place. The arms. Uh, how do we want to do this? <laughs> ah, I see. So, this little groove right there, it clips in right there. like that. Second verse, same as the first. Just like that. This is his head. Bring that around. Take his hand. Plug it in there. And there you have Ripper Snapper in arm mode. Once you get that hooked in there, you can just kind of set his set his head on there. Okay. Now let's go ahead and put him into leg mode. Just open it up. Remember this. This little piece right here has to fit in just right. All right.
is somewhat difficult to do, especially on camera. Ah. Okay, everything else pretty much stays the same except you rotate the race waist around. And then and I mean you don't have necessarily have to rotate it around. I like to. I prefer to. I think it looks better that way. And then you just take the foot piece and you peg it in right there. Make sure the fin's on the back side. And you'll probably want to put take the hand piece. Put it just like that. Peg it in as a heel. There you have Ripper Snapper in leg mode. And, you know, you can put his cannons out like that so that he's, so that uh, Bominus is armed to the teeth, so to speak. So there you have it, guys. This was Transformers Generations Power of the Primes Terracon Ripper Snapper. Take care, geeks. If you enjoyed that video, make sure you hit the subscribe button right there so you can stay up to date on all things geek culture. Also, make sure you check out one of these two playlists on the side for more videos just like the one you just watched. I'm Shannon for Comic Getting TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. Take care, geeks.